Dude, you burn that, dude. <laughs> All right, guys, Dandy Off Road merch finally available. We're going to put links in the description on where you can get your very own Dandy Off Road tee. Would you look at that? Here's the back of it. Matt Show and Dandy Off Road crew. I would totally support this matching in the dinner. I really like it. Again, link in the description, or you can just visit dandyoffroad.com. It's going to be the first thing that pops up when you get there. I don't want there to be any confusion. Look at that. Woo! And it's our signature colors. And a little bit of info about these shirts that might interest you. These shirts are solar powered. They are organic. They are reclaimed. Recycled, recyclable, freeze dried. Raised on a cruelty free farm where no, not one, semi plover nor one blade of milk grass was harmed during the making of these shirts because we love the environment. These can be used as a parachute if you need to jump or exit your vehicle quickly. Once you land, you can then fashion it into a pillow or a blanket. You should get two. A blanket and a pillow. You should definitely get two, I'm thinking. There's so many other uses, so why don't you guys buy one and then show me how you use it. Thank you guys ahead of time, and uh, don't forget, get your dandy off road. First shirt, many more to come. First run, lots of other stuff to come, but... Take a look. Get my dandy off road.com. Okay, we got a co light trying this out, but really what we're doing is heading out right now for a little evening uh, runabout, run out, putt putt, I don't know. Out here in Pismo, day one, Friday. Uh, the wind has died down. Uh, it was basically lifting the trailer up off the ground and slamming it back into the road, uh, ground. Over and over again. Now, it's not so much. So we're going to go out here with our peoples. Uh, Dean should be here shortly. And we are going to go uh, explore a little more of what is in store. Oh, my God. I know. It just comes to me. I don't even know how I do it. So we're going to do a little comparison now. So we're riding. Uh, here's all of our people. And we are going to see what it's like to Can-Am. We took the Razor out, the Turbo West, first time in the sand. New tires, new sand paddles. And uh, we took it out earlier. New terrain in Pismo, something uh, kind of foreign to us. And now we're taking a little pup pad out here. We got some kiddos riding with us. Uh, we got Brandy and Uriah up there in the lead, not Can Am. We got Sherfy right there in his book shot. We got uh, another uh, Razor, I believe Steve. And uh, we got Ben up there. I think he has Brayley with him. Oh, dip, dip, drop, drop. Oh, drop off action there. So here we go, putting around in our automobile. Okay, so kind of trying to see what the difference feels like. Uh, it's a little off camera what the difference feels like. We did, like I said, drove the Turbo S yeah. earlier. Yeah, we'll show you some video of that. Yep, so how does this feel so far? I know it's only been two seconds. So it's such a different feel. Uh, hang on, Ben's got a flat tire. Uh-oh. Ben, you got a copy, you got a flat. What? What's wrong? You got a flat tire. She's clean already, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna go back. Okay. It's scary out here for little ones. Yeah. So here we go. All right, so totally different feel. Uh, different car, different platform altogether, of course. Oh, yeah. You know, so for here's the thing. For the hardcore, you know, Can-Am lovers out there, they're going to be, oh, Razor sucks, or, and, and vice versa, right? Right. But we like both. I just fell in love with that Razor on a different level than before. It's kind of like, oh. Straight out of the box. I mean, I know it has dynamics, so it's supposed to be badass. And we have our tuned up MTS shops, which rock. Totally yeah. different. I don't know. Uh, where's everybody? There they are. Phantom. Now, so. Now, let's go to the drags. <laughs> so, right off the bat, I'm going to say this is just a totally different seating position, different feel altogether, right? Yeah, I like having both, though. I don't yeah. love one more than the other I mean necessarily they're both badass in their own right and I can say that because I know I've put a lot of seat time in both uh, models I mean not this model in particular but both uh, you know I did a lot of years in a razor but so the depth so here's the thing this is a 2017 Canon so it does not have the electronic suspension the razor does the razor is definitely it, less body roll even in this car it's planted uh, is, is pretty planted. We have, you know, MTS shocks, which makes a huge difference. And we are running, like, front sway bar, well, some people won't. Um, are you in four or two? Just asking, because... And, um, so, basically, uh, just overall feel as far as body roll, the rays are super, super planted. It is. I'm surprised by that. I really am. I think in the past, that was the issue for me with the razor, was that it seemed like a lot of body roll, yeah. you know. But, They've adjusted. But this car's tuned, so the suspension feels probably 
that's a little, I'm not going to say smoother because that razor really is going to kick it's, ass. It's smooth. But um, we definitely need to put some more ponies in it because I'm going to tell you right now, yeah. this car um, out here, you, the sand well, robs you of horsepower. Yeah, the razor won't do that for sure. No. Why we just do it? Well, just someone coming around to the left who was back there. Oh, never mind. So, yeah, the razor is definitely a drop off. Uh -huh. Okay, careful. Copy. See that drop off? Yep. So, uh, we could. What we uh, we love the razor, and when it's when it has some power behind it, and we add some little power, which we're gonna, um, it's gonna be a different freaking world. I feel like, do you? Yeah, definitely. But this is the platform itself is kind of what I'm talking about right now. Oh yeah. And it's definitely it's different, but I really really like the razor. I really. You do. fell in love with it today. You said it a couple times, and it's true. It's just straight out of the box, like yeah. oh, it just does the work that you need it to do. Okay, out I here in this. This craziness that we hadn't, it was a good test because it's kind of new to us. This is all new. And basically, that's our car right there. Yep. So, same Looks thing we were talking earlier. That's a pretty much brand new dynamics. Mm hmm. Oh, this video, the sun going down like this. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Careful, though. So, comparison. Turbo S Can Am. Now you've, you know, you've had the Turbo S out here for a little bit, not much, but a little bit. Can Am, you know, kind of just trying it out in this new Pismo that we're at. And so here's the thing, right? It's not a direct comparison because this is not a stock car. Right. It's tuned suspension. It's tuned motor. It's, Are they coming know, up here? No. It's all these things where. The razor is still stock. We haven't touched it yet. Yeah, we're going to... But I really like it. It's it corner so flat. It does everything. It doesn't have any body roll. It just, yeah. like, right out of the box was dialed. Um, the, we tried, like, we tried soft. We tried comfort, I mean. We tried uh, sport. We tried some firm. All working, you know. Landed a couple of sweet jumps, I think. Yeah, yeah. It jumped really well. It landed really well, so... Yeah. God, it feels good. It feels good to me. It feels really good to me. I miss being out in the sand, and I love this car, I do. I love you, so don't get mad at us. Look what happened, Super surprisingly enough. Here, dude. I don't know. <laughs> here you go, sir. Okay. So, what we got here? You got a new belt. Good thing, because I thought we left them all at camp. Darren, he was like being all crazy right now. I know, right. he's out of control. You know? God, the and I could tell he was like getting a little bit more was crazy so on the two-seater. No I mean, yeah, there was no four-seater. He's like, oh, I'm going to get crazy right now. Alright. Hey, there's that new thing. From What's crazy is, hey, I got to the right-hand side, and Brandy's like, hey, Darren's right behind me. I'm like, oh, shoot, Brandy. <laughs> I'm cruising because I don't want to get her dizzy. No, that's right. what we said. We don't want you either. We're yeah. Trying to, I go, good next time I was filming. But I look back and I saw you guys' flags. I'm like, oh, shoot, they're right next to me. No, because it looked cool. <laughs> I was filming because the sunset. Oh. oh it's gonna be so nice. I'm trying to get some good shots. I got dude, it. you burned that, dude. <laughs> <laughs> right, bro. Oh, my goodness. Are the tools in here, babe? Uh-oh, what do you say? Can't take you anywhere. I know. Darren, yeah. you need to clean that out or no? Yeah. Here, hey. You can use my gloves, dude. Here, use my gloves. Here, pull that off. Use my gloves. I know, I have small hands because I have a small. 
That's weird because he's fit me, then. You don't think so? You don't think so? He's all because he fit me. He had my snuggles. But hey, they always say judge your five sizes of your feet. I'm like, yeah, that's about right. What, babe? I said, you need stuff out here? The clutch tool. It's probably not in here. You don't think it's in here? Uh, did we put it back in here? Yeah. Oh, the clutch tool? Oh, shoot. Oh, man. And I left my freaking... I thought we, I thought we had left the belt, too. That's oh, I got my tool up. We had that quick yes. release one. Like you and Danny have, yeah. We are very ill-prepared, apparently. I thought that was the number one priority right there. I got to buy one. Hey, you know, it used to be 80 bucks, right? Now it's like $39 you can buy on Amazon. Yeah, isn't that weird how some stuff got really expensive, but some stuff got cheap? Just like light bar brackets, dude. They were like 150 bucks like five years ago. Oh, my God. I got uh, a freaking half of a flashlight. I got your Oxycontin. I got uh, I got a tire gauge, but I got no old clutch tool, like the screw my box or anything. Where is it, you think? Where? We had it packed for that trip. What do you it's say? Right all right, here we go. For all the real action. Oh, my gosh. All this is coming over here to this one. Hey, babe, how you doing? Mwah. What's going on, guys? What's up? Grace. And Grace, look at my little Grace. Hi, say hi Grace to the camera. And there's Madison. Hi. You gonna say hi? Hi, just wave. <laughs> You're awesome. Oh, good job. You're awesome. All right, who we else? We got Steve and we got Tyler. What's up? What up guys? You guys enjoying everything? Yeah. All right. And then we got the guy that was behind. Okay, who, oh, there's no Braley. Yeah, Braley was crying. Why? She didn't like the pre-dunes. <laughs> I love it. All right, we're having a good time today. S'mores! So I think tonight, Sherfy, I think it's the girls' turn to make the fire, right? Because yesterday it was the guys, right? Absolutely. Babe? How about load firewood? Huh? Load firewood? Yeah. <laughs> you know it's so funny? Because Pizzle seems so small. And you come back over here and it's like the dunes look big, but they're really not. Don't let it fool you. Oh, these are our neighbors right here. What's up, buddy? There's my little sidekick right there. Look at her and her little nice goggles. Oh, look at that big smile. <laughs> look at her. <laughs> I love it. I remember last time I filmed this, dude. I remember Brandy grabbed it out of my hand. She's like, Channel 57. Because <laughs> I was like, we're out. Channel 57. And you're like, what? Channel 57. <laughs> I'll bring one. I'll bring the one we have. I think it's on the work. Are you, are you going from the bottom up? I'm feeling like I saw it sitting on the bench. There we go. Or do we go top to bottom? What do we do on these? I forgot. We go top, bottom, bottom, up, side, side, whatever you want to do. Just get on there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There we go. Yay! I think I was staring at the chassis, you know, when we were doing that, so but here you go. Here we go. We're going to try this again without the breaking of the belts. We fixed the clutch. Sometimes it just needs a little attitude adjustment, I think.
two, three. Go.